Now the other day while your rage was streaming on kick, the chat starts to troll him by saying that DYK is back and mentions Bruce's new music collective Ball Hog. We are back. Nothing about us is back. <laughs> Ball Hog fucking summer. What are you saying, updates? It, updates, what are you saying? Are you ready for Ball Hog summer? Bro, you are we gonna talk about it? I'm genuinely just stuck right now. I don't know what the f I wanna do right now. The donations are saying gibberish, but chat is is loving it. Just apologize to Bruce and kiss the ring and he might sign you. Be quick before all the spots are gone. Who the f this nigga just told me to apologize to? And for the 30th, 40th, and probably 50th time, your rage would address everything related to Bruce Shop him off. Is DYK back? We are so back. We are so back. Now we need to bully Kai back to liking Bruce. I don't ever go back to my exes, chat. Once you an ex, you an ex. That's tough. My exes stay where they at. You be, it's like a loop. It's like a cycle. It's like a cycle and a cycle. I, I ain't going back to the cycle, gang. Like, I can't go back to the cycle type shit. That's why all my, left, my exes, they stay, you know what I'm saying? Even if I don't got no beef with my exes. From a distance, it's like these. You know, ain't no beef. It's just like, I just don't want to, I don't, I don't, I just don't care, bro. Like, I don't care. You can't force me to care. I don't care. I mean, you, you have to force me to care. You can't, for, I don't care no more. I don't care. Like, it is what it is. I ain't going back to the loop. Today is a good day. What's going to happen when it's a bad day? Now niggas going to crash out and all. I'm not dealing with that shit, bro. I'm not. I ain't, I can't deal with it no more. Can't. Nope. I'm good. I'm cool, gang. I'm glad you're on Twitch, though. I didn't that nigga funny, you know what I'm saying? So that's good for the viewers, nigga. It's good for the viewers, you know what I'm saying? Bro, you can literally be DEO and then be Kyle Mafia and then be w YRG without, like, having internal boundaries. We don't got to be friends, gang. We do not have to be friends. Like, it's cool. You can watch everybody and be normal. So basically, your rage would troll and entertain the idea of a DYK reunion until Kai reeled them in and let him know what happened, what could potentially happen if they try to reconcile the situation in the future. I go lie though. I almost folded. You know how, you know how them exes almost get you, bro? Like, oh, fuck, like... Maybe, you know what I'm saying, give it another chance type shit. These past few months, I almost fought. I ain't gonna lie. You heard me saying, like, the room for one more with Kai. With Kai being in Discord, you know, good and goddamn well. Kai didn't want to hear none of that shit. He don't want to hear nothing to do with that nigga. But I'm still trolling to make it the situation, like, lighthearted. Y'all, like, room for one more nigga type shit. You know what I'm saying? But that nigga gave me a reality check quick as shit. He gave me a reality check quick as shit. Do not go back. Do not go back. You know what I'm saying? That last situation when I was upset at a nigga's Twitter community, his Twitter community, and Kai's Twitter community. And he somehow turned that into me throwing shade on his name for the fat past few months when the whole time I was the one who got shit talked behind their back. Not even shit that y'all seen on Twitter. I was the one who got shit talked, and I'm low key like turning it into a joke. And then now it's, you, you kept talking about me. Keep my name. I'm gonna keep your name out of my mouth. No more. No more. Okay? No more, chat. From now on, how I feel right now, never again. Never again. Okay? We'll keep it like that. That's just it. That's it. It's not beef. It's not weird. It's not nothing. It's just like. We don't gotta do this type shit. We don't gotta be cool. I mean, not cool. We don't gotta be friends. Just like that. And chat, please, please, please don't ever let no nigga tell you, make it seem like I lied about anything or, or, or misconstrued something or took something out of context. That, that's cap. Don't do that, please, please. Okay, chat. That's all I'm saying. Do not let anybody think I lied about anything in life ever. Okay, and that's all I'm saying. As this is going on, Bruce actually joins his chat, asking to talk, and the two have a conversation from his chat. And your rage shuts down this idea of them talking on stream. Bro, Bruce, bro, we don't, I don't think there's nothing to talk about, gang. Cause we could talk and everything could be good. And if there's a day where like, you're not in a good mood, like all that is scrap. I don't think we need to talk, gang. I promise you, if you talk on the phone right now, it's gonna be a good conversation, but it's just gonna be a loop. It's gonna be a cycle and shit. I don't feel like dealing with that, bro. Like, I just don't. At least right now. Right now, I'm cool. Right now, I'm cool as shit. So don't say I'm lying when I'm telling... Wait, lying about what? Wait, what are you talking about? The fuck is you talking about? What am I lying about? If I call you, it's off stream. I'm not calling you on no stream, nigga. Like, that's dead. That's dead as fuck. <laughs> that's crazy, actually. That's crazy. I'm not calling you on a stream, nigga. Y'all want content so bad. Call it. Y'all want content so... What'd he say? It went by. Pin it. By the way, Bruce, or anybody in chat, it wasn't all no, like, he said this. No. Why are you mad? Bruce, don't ask me why. Me of all people are mad, bro. Ta -ha -ha. See, this nigga in a trolley, bro. This nigga's in a trolley. This nigga's in a good mood, bro. Had this be a bad week, and it will be up. <laughs> Yo, block, ban this nigga. Yo, see, y'all y'all gonna see me laughing, right? I'm laughing. But y'all gonna make you think shit sweet. No, no. Ban that nigga. Get that nigga gone. They gotta see that nigga tight, bro. See y'all to think I'm laughing? Y'all to see me laughing and think shit is God, nigga. No, nigga, no. You see that nigga tight mods? You fucking 
You time that nigga, nigga, all right? You time that nigga. I swear to God, you time that nigga. You getting niggas hopes up, bro. Niggas are saying we back. You getting niggas hopes up, nigga. Niggas gonna be disappointed. Another quick thing I forgot to mention was that Bruce was supposed to be in this current iteration of Phase along with Jinxie and Jideon. I did go on Max stream and Max said the original Phase was about to be um him, Jideon, and me, I guess, or some shit like that. No chat, the OG Phase, Kason put together, he wanted to do me, Bruce, Jideon, and yeah, that was it. I was like, bro, we need like a white boy or some shit. We need like, you know what I'm saying? We need like a normal, like we all niggas. I'm like, let's get Jinxie. That's before Jinxie was who he was. And I knew Bruce good and goddamn well wasn't gonna join no house, bro. Like, I barely wanna join the fucking house, bro. So I know that nigga not gonna join no house. And that's when I said, let's do Max. But I fully understand why your rage is keeping his distance from Bruce because one bad day could ruin whatever fresh start they try to have. And we know how Bruce is when he has smoke with people, especially the ones who speak on him. Like Lil Yachty, for example. Yachty posted a tweet about Bruce that he would later delete saying that, brother, I've never in my life copied a thing from Bruce. Ask Bruce who he got his girls made by, why he got that Chanel bag. Stop Stop playing with me, bro. This nigga was a child playing on a computer when I was getting fly. This nigga not no mood boards of mine. F are you talking about? And Bruce will respond with a few tweets of his own and trolls him on stream. Ever since his return to Twitch the other day, Bruce has had time to respond to every naysayer, from Keemstar to Convy and even Cheezer. Now, the one person that would not really give him that much energy compared to your rage is Kai, who quickly addressed Bruce after someone posted about his return in his Reddit. Bruce apologizes to Kai, admits his faults in his Twitch return, also gives him soccer advice. Hey, bro, that's, 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 that's I cool. I love how hard he- That's cool. What does that got to do? Why would I like, bro, y'all? Do you okay? Bro, let me take you time. Chat, this is what I be talking about. I don't talk about certain situations because in my real life, I've went through it and I've made the smart decision on making my circle the way it's supposed to be. You guys are too invested and it's crazy. It's so bad. It's actually bad, I'm not gonna lie, bro. You feel what I'm saying? We got to work this year. We got so much shit I gotta do. Can we please just stop? Like, it's so bad, bro. It's like, it's so, it's forced. It's actually forced. I haven't spoken the situation since I spoke on the situation. Let that sink in. This led people in the comments to say many of the things that we heard before, like Bruce fell off and needs clout, et cetera, et cetera. Which is actually false, by the way. He came back to 40,000 viewers and is probably gonna average between 15 and 20K. He's gonna be all right. And I honestly feel like these fan bases should let this DYK thing go. It's looking like the shield at this point. The good old days are not coming back. Yeah, now, well, the thing about the old days, they the old days. But I had to give a quick follow up on the last video because I forgot to mention some things and obviously things that happened later on I couldn't record because obviously they did not happen. But let me know what you guys think about this whole situation in the comments. It's Fargo and I'm out man.